Welcome back. I'm Walt Kane. We are in your corner. Senior citizens are feeling the pinch in today's rocky economic climate. Many older Americans are facing the threat of foreclosure, and many seniors are simply not aware there are financial options available to them. It could be a loan modification or a bankruptcy or what some claim is the easiest and quickest way out of foreclosure, a reverse mortgage. Here to tell us about all of these options is Sandra Rostick, an expert in FHA reverse mortgages. She's been in government lending for 25 years and currently runs the Senior Solutions Workshop for Lakeland Bank. Sandra, thanks for being with us. Thanks for having me. Uh, why don't we start with the, with the loan modification process. Uh, you know, if you're a senior in particular, although this would hold true for anybody who's in financial trouble, uh, how do you go about trying to get your lender to, to modify the loan? Well, you can call the lender directly. They're really they're on the ball these days uh, processing loan modifications but you can also call a government agency it's a housing agency that's funded for um, loan modifications mm -hmm. the the number is 800 oh, I'm sorry 888-995-HOPE okay. and that is the Hope Preservation Foundation they're federally funded and they're free so now, now, seniors have a particular problem here because they're they tend to be on fixed incomes so, right. so they would really have to be able to what demonstrate that they could they can make it that's even right. with the modification. All the, all the guidelines, the HAMP guidelines, the Home Affordable guidelines say that you need to be able to afford your house within 31 percent of your income. And a senior that has $1,800 worth of Social Security income... That's going to be very they, tough. Yeah, they can't make it. It's, it's less than $600. That's the real estate taxes in New Jersey right. alone. So, so if modification won't work out, um, obviously the, the worst case uh, is bankruptcy. Yep. Uh, wh what, what are the considerations there? Well, bankruptcy, they'll, they'll re, um, you know, recast all of your your debt, they'll help let you catch up on arrears, but again, you have to make a mortgage payment. You have to be able to carry that debt. And if you were having trouble to begin with, and, and you know, so, so you're that may, still that may have not get you out of the, it may not get you out of the debt and in, still in the house. That's right. It might be the line. answer, you know, if you right. have a pension and decent income. But if you're mo like most, social, you know, Social Security recipients, you're. It's hard. Now, the reverse mortgage is something that uh, that we're hearing more and more about. Uh, as I understand it, basically, uh, this, this works if you've paid off your house or, or have quite a bit of equity in your house, and basically now you're mortgaging it sort of in reverse. Well, people think that it's for houses that are paid off, but they don't realize that we can give them a reverse mortgage to pay off a foreclosed loan, to pay off any kind of debt. If you're just looking towards the future and you can make your mortgage payment, you can get a reverse mortgage and satisfy it and not have a mortgage payment So you're, you're basically borrowing more against the house as you need it and eventually the, the bank will wind up owning the house if you, if you don't that's long what, enough. That's what everybody thinks. It's a misconception. The bank does not well, get your house Well, presumably this would be if you, if you wound up doing it long enough to, to the point that I guess you, you didn't have enough equity in it. Well, but actually, the title stays in your name. Your okay. heirs inherit the house. It's just a mortgage. It's, it's just FHA. additional debt. Yeah, it's an FHA insured mortgage. You can pay it off anytime you want. You can sell the house tomorrow. There are so many scams out there uh -huh. that are targeting seniors, and, and you hear about it all the time. Yep. What does a senior need to watch out for? Well, um, you know, I think that the biggest scare right now is seniors are losing their house to back taxes. They go up for a tax auction, somebody buys the note, and after two years they can foreclose on the house. And somehow it gets fast-tracked through the municipality. It's like you wake up one day and you don't own your house anymore. And they just, they're afraid of the reverse or they don't know about it, but that's the solution. They can just get a reverse and pay their back taxes, but instead they're losing their houses like crazy. And you know, everybody's in trouble, and nobody's really paying attention to the seniors. Well, and there, there's this scam that, that makes the rounds that people seem mm -hmm. to fall for, where um, yep. you, you will buy the house from you and, and let you uh, live in it, uh, and, and but uh, once you sign title to, to your house over, no matter what the pretense is, once you've signed it over, it's not your house anymore. Yeah, never sign anything except a loan modification with your lender. Never sign anything without an attorney. And, you know, always try to get an attorney involved, because the attorney has to answer the complaints, and and make sure that you don't go to auction while you're talking to your lender about the loan modification or a reverse mortgage. So, you know, you have to be very involved and, and be proactive to save your house. A lot of seniors are just homebound, though, and, you know, they get in trouble. They don't tell anybody about it. So other so, people have to step in and, and lend a hand. All right. So with us, Kane in your corner. We'll be right back in a moment. Hey, Bedminster, stay tuned. Your news continues right here on News 12 New Jersey.